Hello everyone, you're watching District Endocrine channel and this is Dr. Rahman. I am an ABIM uh, board certified endocrinologist. Um, welcome to the latest video on Mediterranean diet. Mediterranean diet gained popularity in 1960s when it was observed that in countries, particularly Italy and Greece, had fewer deaths from heart diseases. Um, this was attributed to the differences in the dietary choices when compared to the United States and the Northern Europe. Uh, Mediterranean diet typically includes vegetables, fruits, beans, whole grains, seeds and nuts. Uh, it emphasizes on the poultry, fish, and dairy products with limited consumption of the red meat. Um, it does recommend to avoid processed foods and extra sweetened drinks. So the question is, is Mediterranean diet safe? So Mediterranean diet includes olive oil, uh, which has monounsaturated fats and is excellent for heart. Uh, this is an excellent uh, source of uh, high quality fat, so that's great. Um, multiple research trials have shown that the Mediterranean diet is associated with reduced incidence of stroke and overall it has been shown to reduce cardiovascular mortality that is people dying from the heart diseases. Uh, moreover, it has been shown to have beneficial impact on um, Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's disease and possibly some cancers such as prostate, colorectal, oropharyngeal or even breast cancers. World Health Organization recognizes the Mediterranean diet as a sustainable and healthy dietary pattern which is very easy to follow. Um, it is sustainable as compared to other diets which may not be well balanced for example to name a few keto diets and all the other uh, you know low fat diet etc. People living in the countries that border the Mediterranean Sea follow this diet for whole of their life basically uh, which translate to their low heart disease prevalence in that particular part of the world. Uh, it is very close to American Heart Association dietary recommendations except that Mediterranean diet has higher content of fat when you try to compare them in, in greater depth. So, that is it safe for uh, diabetes patients? Of course yes. Uh, this can be used for extended period of uh, time uh, in patients who have type 1 diabetes or type 2 diabetes. Um, uncontrolled diabetes patients should always look, watch out for carbohydrate content and sometimes extra fat content in these patients can also cause the blood sugar to go high, although it doesn't happen in every patient. Well, that was my video on um, Mediterranean diet. I'm gonna make another video where we'll talk more about the list of ingredients that make up Mediterranean diet. So watch out for that video. Um, thank you for watching this video. Um, subscribe to the channel for more content uh, on the dietary and the lifestyle topics. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Ciao.